you guys are looking to buy FIFA coins with fast delivery and cheap prices or open up FIFA packs on a brand new website for real coin totals, check out FIFACoinZone.com and use the code HABER to get yourself 5% off. Good morning everybody, happy Thursday, happy rewards day, welcome back to a brand new video. Today what we were doing is of course some rewards. I am very excited to rip open these rewards today. Uh, we have got, of course, rivals and champs rewards for you today. So hopefully we can get something good in this video. It is currently about 20 seconds to 8 a.m. I am shattered, but you know what? We're going to jump straight into it as well. We're actually, for some reason, starting on my account, which doesn't make a whole lot of sense because, as you see, I've got rank four rewards, which is two uh, it's a premium gold players and a jumbo premium gold pack, I think. And then, of course, you'll see in a second, my champ's just like silver too. It, it really isn't good. Um, I think I played nine games of champs this week or something like that and then just stopped because I just don't like champs, to be honest. So, yeah, I was, wasn't enjoying it at all. Yeah, silver too. So, I thought we'd open them up anyway. We've got one of two players, max 84 overall. Let's have a look who we get. Uh, and we get Delefeu, to be fair. That's actually not bad. Uh, considering we get max 84 overall, we got an 84 Premier League player. That is not too shabby. I, you know, I'll take that. In terms of Silver 2, that is not too bad. And, of course, we have the packs that we just said. Uh, all of them being tradable as well. So, we have a Jumbo Premium Gold Pack and Premium Gold Players Pack. We'll open those two first. These are from Rivals. So, we probably won't get anything from either of them. But they are both tradable, like I said. So, hopefully, we get something good. And the first one is going to be Martin Martin. Don't know, uh, don't know about that one, Chief. But we've got a few plays. And you know what? For playing, like, I've played one Rivals game and, like, eight Champs games. The packs aren't even that bad, to be honest. Uh, 15k and a 25k pack for playing, like, what? Like, nine nine games? I don't think that's too bad, to be honest. I thought we just got the same person twice. Uh, yeah, I don't think that's too bad, to be fair. I think that's all right. Um, pretty fair. So... We have got now a rare gold pack and a mega pack for playing my eight champs games. Come on, yeah. Imagine, imagine we got something good from this. Imagine we got no walkout in my uh, in my rare gold pack. I'm probably expecting no walkouts here uh, and no boards to be honest either. I'm, I'm not expecting a board here either. Uh, we've got like an upgraded Piontech there, and then we have got a mega pack. Come on, yeah. Imagine, imagine you just give us something good for once randomly. In a, no, I was going to say in silver two rewards. No, no boards. So. Let's get into the actual rewards now. Okay, so now we are on Moonhead's account, ready to open up Moonhead's rewards. Before, I wanted to just check one thing, because he says he's a first owner uh, club in his club name. And it is a first owner, Ramos, to be fair. That's actually very, very impressive. I'm guessing all these players are first owner. Wow, that that's impressive. That is very, very impressive. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. So, let's go ahead and open up his rewards. He has got his division rivals and foot champs. Uh, I think he said that he finished in, in rank, I think, 1, division 5 or 4 for rivals. Um, he's got two mega packs, two 50k packs, and two uh, Prango place packs. So that's division 3, actually, maybe, or 4. Um, but that's definitely rank 1, 100% rank 1. Yeah, so we've got rank 1 rivals awards. Uh, we'll go ahead and claim those. And then we have got the champs rewards, which I think think i remember him saying gold two gold two so that's 17 wins on the weekend um and we got for that two player picks of four items a rare gold pack two rare mega packs and forty-five thousand coins we actually have a chance to get a messy in these because the other one we didn't because it was a 84 max so ea if you're feeling generous a messy would be appreciated let's see imagine we got a messy i'd freak out dude i would freak out all right so we're gonna start off with delafeu it's actually not a bad card, to be fair. Apart from the stamina, jumping, and strength, and aggression, and yeah. Uh, it's not too bad. I'm tired. All right, second play pick now. Come on, EA. Hook a brother up. Hook a bro up. Damn, dude. That's disappointing. I mean, it's a, it's, it's Delefeu and Mandy. It's disappointing, but you know what? I guess we'll take it. Um, we'll go ahead and store both of those and see if maybe the champs rewards and rival rewards can 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 pay out. Hopefully, please, yay. Yeah. So we're gonna start off, of course, with the prime gold. Uh, yeah, we'll start off with the prime gold players pack. You know, I'm not gonna go. I'm not gonna open them up individually. I'm just gonna go left to right with the best packs to the worst packs. So the worst packs to the best packs, even, and just see if that can work. So we're starting off with a board. Actually, it's gonna be a Belgian left mid. It's gonna be Yannick Carrasco. 83 rated. I mean, it's all right, to be fair. It's not horrendous. It's not great, though. Um, 
we'll take it. It's a board. A board is a board, to be fair. And if there's anything coming tomorrow, like a promo or whatnot, then they'll obviously be useful. Um, I think that all, obviously the rares and non-rares are always going to be useful if there's a promo coming the next day because if we get repeatable SBCs, they'll be very useful. So next prime gold plays pack, that's not a board. It's going to be Begovic. Disappointing, but again, plays in the club. You know, that that's the best part about it. Especially if you're doing the first turn of Road of Glory, having players in the club for SBCs. That is, uh, that's probably the best thing to do. So, rare gold player, rare gold player, rare gold pack now. Come on, EA. Nothing from this. It's going to be a board. We're going to have a board from this. What's it going to be? It's going to be Croatian, center mid, Kovacic. All right, that's all right. We'll take it, 83, another board. We'll take another board. I don't think either of them have any value, though. The 83s are kind of like meh, you know? They're kind of like meh. Um, that one was some champs rewards as well, so... What do we got? We got two mega packs, two rare player packs, two rare mega packs. So we'll start for the mega packs, then go rare players pack, then go rare mega packs to end off the video. So, first mega pack. Come on, EA. No board, man. Come on, EA. What are you doing? Let's not have a week of just absolute trash this week, huh? Let's have a week of a little bit better this week. Come on, EA. We want it. We want some good stuff. All right. So we got Mustafi in there. Nothing really. Shout home about you know I should probably check if these these are tradable counterparts as well or for the most part anyway we should probably just uh, get the coins in the club there. Um, okay, so next mega pack, yeah man, just give us something decent for once, please. No walkout again in the mega pack. Disappointing to be honest. What we're we gonna get here? It's gonna be Spanish striker. Ooh, Diego Costa eighty five is not bad. I don't actually know how much the 85s are going for, to be honest. Diego Costa. I, I don't know if the 85s still hold a huge value or not. At one point, they were like 20,000 coins. So, he's back down to about 11k. But that's still not bad. Holds a decent value, especially if we do get anything tomorrow. Um, that is actually pretty solid. So, we'll store all that. Now, we've got two rare player packs. Hopefully, we can get something good from the rare player packs. Come on, EA. Give us something decent. Let's see that walkout symbol. Let's go. Come on, walkout. Come on. What's it going to be? Please, somewhere decent. Senegalese, center back. Kula Bali is not bad at all, actually. Don't know how much Kula Bali is going for, but that is actually solid. That right there is solid. 88 rate Kula Bali is about 40,000 coins on the PlayStation. That is not bad. We'll take it. 88 rated, obviously got the upgrade, so that is pretty solid. Great again, if you need it for an SBC or anything like that. We've got upgraded a pie, Willem Carvalho. That is actually pretty decent. I, I think that's a decent pack. That's a really decent pack. 284 is in there, of course. An 83 in Luis Gustavo. Not bad at all. We'll discard the rest and we'll just uh, we'll store that into the club. All right, come on, EA. Let's replicate that. Let's get another walkout. Give us another symbol. Come on. Back to back. Yes, back to back walkouts. Come on. Come on. What's it going to be? It's going to be Argentinian. Cam. Is that Dybala? Oh, my word. Dybala, that's insane. Yo, that is so lucky. About 100,000 coins. That is actually incredible. An 88 followed by an 89 in back-to-back -back walkouts. That is incredible. You do not get a look like that, especially in rewards. That is actually solid. Really happy with that. Yo, and an upgraded Robertson in there as well. That is actually really solid. Let's go. I think, honestly, I think Mina's going to be very, very happy with that. We'll go ahead and obviously just quickly swap all these guys at the end and uh, send the, 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 well, all of them down to the discard pile. But we'll send those into the club. That is actually really sick. Now, of course, we have the trade all packs now, the two rare mega packs. If we get anything good from these, that's just a bonus. Go on. No walkout in the first one. I am really chuffed with that because being a first owner of Rotor Glory and whatnot, um, I think that's probably actually really solid. You know, that, 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 that's great. He can use that Dybala if he wants to in-game and whatnot. That's that's really sick. Happy about that. And plus, I think it's just really good to uh, to, to get those players in back-to-back -back packs. To be honest, that's actually really solid. I don't think I've, uh, I've had back-to-back -back packs that good. So, we're going to end it off now with a rare mega pack. Go on, EA. Hook a brother up. Yes, we've got a walkout in the last pack. Come on. What's it going to be? It's going to be Bosnian centimeter. It's going to be Pjanic. Don't know how much Pjanic is going for, but it's a walkout in the last pack. How much are you, Milan Pjanic? Milan Pjanic, how much are you going for, son? About 20,000 coins just under. That's pretty solid, to be fair. Really decent. We'll take that. 
not bad at all. Uh, send them up to the transfer list. We'll uh, see if there's anything else to uh, shout home about. We've got a loan pack. I'm not even going to open that. I'm going to I'm going to spare you guys of the loan pack because no one cares about them. No one cares, all right? Now, let's jump over to, I think his name's Dency or Denchi. I don't know how to say because it it's Dutch. But let's go and open up his rewards now. Before we go to the rewards, literally really quickly, I just want to say my shout out to uh, to GT Omega for sending me out the brand new chair. You can find a link below if you guys want to purchase products from them. Use code HEYBA to get yourself 5% off. They're really solid chairs. It feels super comfy. So uh, yeah, massive shout out to them. Now for Dents, I want to say it's Dency. It's D-E-N-C-E-Y. I want to say it's Dency, but it might be Denchi. I'm not entirely sure. Like I said, it's Dutch. Anyway, now for his rewards. Um, he got... Yes, he stayed in rank two. Let's go. So he's got two untradeable ultimate packs to open, which is fantastic. I'm very excited to open both of those. Rank two in, in, in Division one, which is awesome. Very, very good. And then, of course, we have Foot Champions, which, as you guys can see, is Elite one. So we get the two 100k packs, two premium team of the week packs, three player picks of five items, 125,000 coins, and 2,000 foot champs points. So we're going to get messy. This is the best chance we've got this week of getting a red messy. Come on. Come on, EA. This is the best chance I've got personally because I'm not opening any of the rewards. But, you know, hopefully we can get something good. So we're starting off with either Izzo or Delefeu. Now, this card actually started off as an 83. EA made a mistake and changed it to an 84. It doesn't even look that bad of a card. I'm going to go with Delefeu first of all because I feel like Premier League is always easy to link if, we, if you're using it for an SBC. So it's just, uh, I think Premier League's probably better for that sort of stuff because I, I guarantee these cards aren't making it into his team. Uh, then we have the second player pick. Messi, 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 Messi. All right, we got Super Sitch, 85. Not bad. Okay, we'll take it. We're getting into the, uh, we're getting into the SBC ballpark. EA, please though. If you can give me Messi, give us Messi, please. Please. Come on, EA. Come on. Come on. No messy today. We've got a Milik or an Izzo. I think the best option here is to go with Izzo because Italian links and whatnot. Um, I think it's probably easy to link. We've got 284s and 85. Good SBC fodder, but apart from that, nothing too spectacular. In fact, let's have a quick look at his team right now. That's his team. Considering he finishes Elite 1 every single week, pretty much, and, and he does very well in Champions, I think that is actually... Not even that good of a team. If you like, like if you look at the teams of the good players this year, like the fact that he competes with them and he's got that team is actually very impressive. So we'll start off with the rival awards, two ultimate packs. Yeah, let's get something good to to put into his team. Let's see if we can get a Ronaldo so he can sell his Ronaldo and upgrade his team. Come on, first one's going to be a walkout. Let's go. Come on, it's going to be an inform walkout. Messi, go on, just do it. Spanish striker. Oh, Delefeu. Ah, I mean, okay. It is actually really good. And the reason that I think it's a lot better than what you're probably thinking, obviously we just took a red Delefeu, is because this one counts as an inform towards SBC. So if it wants to, for example, an icon SBC, and it requires a team of the week player, obviously it counts towards being a team of the week player. So that's actually really decent. Even if we can't use both of them in the same SBC, that's really solid. So that's that's good. That's actually a good a good play to get. 84 informs are fantastic to get. As well as we've got an 85 Lacazette, an 84 Will and Carvalho. It's not amazing. It's not fantastic. It's nothing really to shout home about, but it's decent. It's decent and we'll take it. So, not bad. We've got an A4 in form to start off. Let's see if we can get back-to-back -back walkouts with our two ultimate packs for division rivals. Come on. Back-to-back -back walkouts? Yes, back-to-back -back walkouts. Come on. What's it going to be in the second one? Please, something good. Yang. That is very good. That right there is very, very good. Yang. Let's go. All right, and it's upgraded, of course. As you guys remember, Bamiyan got an upgrade. It's about 106,000 coins on the PlayStation. Obviously, it's not sellable, but that is fantastic. That is actually really solid. That's an amazing bench player if he needs one. An inform in there, Diego Costa, 84 Devry. Anything else in the duplicates? Uh, all right, nothing in the duplicates, but that is actually fantastic. We've had three amazing walkouts so far. That is actually really solid. So that's huge. I'm really happy with that. So that's back to back walkouts there. Um, when I say three amazing walkouts, I mean like we've had we've had a Bamyang, Dabala earlier, and Kulabali earlier as well. I don't mean three on this on, on these rewards specifically. Alright, so we've got two 100 k packs. Come on, EA. Let's get something good from these as well. Give us that walkout symbol. No walkout in the first one. It's disappointing. But we've got a board. 85, please. 
84. 84 Schmeichel. I mean, it could there could be some good decent stuff, like maybe like a a few decent 84s in here, possibly. I mean, we've got an upgraded Dembele. It's not too bad. Who am I kidding? It's it's pretty bad. It's pretty bad. It's not good at all, actually. We'll store all that and discard Casilla. Come on. EA, give us a walkout in this 100k pack, please. Come on, EA. Give us a walkout. Yes, a walkout. Come on. Be something good. What's it going to be? Please be something good. I mean, not, 90 Godin is great. You just you really hope that's going to be Suarez there. But 90 Godin is still fantastic. 56,000 coins on the PlayStation. That's actually pretty solid. That's really decent. And he's tradable as well. There could be something good in the pack as well. Because 90 raid is high rated. I mean, there isn't anything good in the pack. But there could have been. <laughs> there could have been. We did hold out hope. So that's actually pretty solid, to be fair. Can't argue with that. So we're sending them to the transfer list. We'll send the rest in the club and discard those two players. Now we have two premium team of the week packs. Now, in terms of the team of the week, obviously we want Messi. Verratti, Javi Martinez, Jovic, Subasic, Tarkovsky, Castellet. Any of the 85s or above would be fantastic. There's a few 84s in there that are decent as well. Zaha, Delefe, you are decent. So, But we really want that Messi. That Messi would pay out big. It would help him improve his team massively. Come on, EA. Give us a Messi, please. Walk out. Yeah, that's good news. That is good news already. That's very good news. Come on. Come on. Oh, okay. I was going to say Jovic there. It's it's Subasic. 85 Subasic is not bad. We're going to start off with a Subasic. Don't know how much he goes for. I thought it was Jovic, to be honest. 31,000 coins for Subasic. What else have we got? Go on, show two more 84s in there. One more 84 is actually not bad, to be fair. Okay, so we've got 31k Subasic. We've got... How much are you going for, Delefeu? Delefeu is uh, 27,000 coins. So that's actually not bad. That's about... What, add the 9,000 we get for Bolly there. That's about 67, 68,000 coins. That's not bad. That's not a bad first pack. 68-ish thousand coins. I think so far in rewards, it's not done too badly. All right, second premium team of the week pack. Come on, EA. That's what you hate to see. That is That right there is what you hate to see. Best case scenario is we get like Jaden Sancho or 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 maybe Antonio or someone like that in this pack. But that like that's like best case scenario here because that's just that's just not good. Alright, we've got Antonio. I don't think he's actually selling for a whole lot at all. I think he's like he's about twenty two thousand coins, but it's the best revive that we could get from that. So I guess we'll take it. Not bad to be fair. And uh, Denzi was saying that his rewards are trash. So I think we've done really well from him. We had a couple of insane walkouts today. Very happy with it so far. And uh, hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, leave a like down below. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new around here. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see you lads later.